having been selected as the party president by the Congress Working Committee, Sonia Gandhi formally took charge of the party's parliamentary wing when she was unanimously elected the chairperson of the Congress Parliamentary Party. In order to accommodate her in this unique post, the party had to amend its CPP constitution, since Sonia is at present not a member of either the Lok Sabha or the Rajya Sabha. Her name was proposed by outgoing CPP leader and former Congress President Sitaram Kesri and seconded by Sharad Pawar. The appointment of Sonia Gandhi as party president and chairperson was hailed by all the party leaders. In her acceptance speech, Sonia affirmed that the party would give constructive support to the BJP-led government. Critics maintain that Sonia Gandhi's biggest challenge will be to revitalize the Congress party organization. Many observers have argued that despite the crowds that Sonia Gandhi drew in recent election, these could not be converted into votes because of inherent infirmities in the Congress party's grassroots structure. Analysts contend that Sonia Gandhi will have to revamp the entire party machinery ruthlessly, but the question that arises is whether vested interests will allow her to do so. The agenda before Sonia Gandhi will also have to include certain policy thrusts the Congress party must embark on. These have the emotive content to win back the traditional Congress voters. The biggest challenge before Sonia Gandhi will be to restore a degree of credibility to the party image, which has taken a battering in recent years. Critics feel that she can do this only by redefining the Congress image and playing the role of a constructive opponent in the parliament. Experts feel that only after this session will Sonia Gandhi reveal her entire game plan.